first time I came up with that riff, we were on tour in Europe, and um, I was having a guitar on the bus, and I was just playing around, and that riff kind of came out, and uh, I remember I kind of played with it for a bit, and then we tried it out at sound check one day, and uh, we were, we all kind of jammed that whole intro bit, the da na 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 and it had this really uh, galloping kind of rhythm to it and sounded pretty badass. And our tour manager at the time, <clears throat> Sam Mitchum, walked walked into the, the, the onto the stage and he was like, what was that song? And I was like, that's oh, a new idea I was kind of working on. He's like, it sounds like a Viking death march. And we all just thought it was such a, it was cool, it's a, a cool name, so it just kind of stuck. And uh, that's how it ended up being that name. We called it. We called it that for probably a year as a tentative title, and we were going to change it eventually. And then uh, when the lyrics started developing, you know, it kind of uh, had a lot to do with what a Viking death march would be, <laughs> if you can imagine what that would be. It still blows me away that um, the first song on our first album, "How It Goes," we can still get this massive response to our first, basically, song on our first record, and then. Viking Death March, we're getting the same sort of similar response when, you know, the beginning of the song starts and then kicks in, the whole place just erupts and it really is a blast playing live and uh, I think the video that we made for it is perfect. I think uh, the fact that it was the first song on the record that we finished and, you know, we still had about probably eight or, eight or nine more songs to finish vocally but that song was done and we just wanted people to hear what we've been up to and to have that as the, the title track. It's just great. It's just everything just worked out perfectly with that song. Now the time is now we can still turn